and welcome. Baboons live in a troop, and in that troop, as opposed to most of the animals, baboons are promiscuous. That is, they are mated every now and then by the young baboons. Uh, but when they reach uh, maturity and becomes on heat or experience or get estrus, they are only mated by the dominant male. And after fertilization, they carry their pregnancy for 180 days. After that, they give birth to a young uh, baby that is completely black in color with a pink face and ears. And that baby remains that way, being carried under the belly of the mother and acquire the, start acquiring the mature baboon's color when he turns from the, uh, the age of two weeks and above. The baboons with me here has given birth to twins, and this is usually not common. But baboons, even when they give birth to, to, give birth to twins, they raise their baby cooperatively. And that is why this mother is doing this work of lactating those, uh, the, her babies and raising them up at ease. This is because occasionally she is helped by the others. Even in times of danger, when they appear, they defend and protect themselves cooperatively, and the babies are assisted and helped by everybody in that particular troop. That is why this case of baboons begin giving twins and raising them cooperatively is very easy. We will talk more about them. They will continue being lactated for the next three and a half months to four months. Welcome. And welcome. Baboons live in a troop. And in that troop, as opposed to most of the animals, baboons are promiscuous. That is, they are mated every now and then by the young baboons. Uh, but when they reach uh, maturity and becomes on heat or experience or get estrus, they are only mated by the dominant male.